Hello everyone, I'm Kozlix, and this is your Daily Dose of Brahala. The last stock of this set was wild. Just stay for the highlight reel now with these dashes. Oh, oh, again, he catches the spot dodge. Impala's got oh. it all figured out. It's not over yet, but it's so close. Who's going to take this? Jade's so... Jade's close, but wait a second. This could be... No, Jade's still alive, but Impala's got stage control and weapon control. Stealing that weapon away before he can grab it. Again, there's a weapon on the field. Jade oh, no. grabs it, but Impala stacks him dodge. away. It's anybody's game here. Don't panic, Jade jump. Don't land panic, jump. Stop, stop side air. It's not enough. The weapon toss. Impala's got the defense. Finish the stock. Recovery. Oh. He misses the recovery. Back to the stage oh. with the spear. Sayer, the bow's going to be picked up. And you know that down stick is going to be the available. There, the recovery is there. He's at the top of the screen. And Paula takes out Luna and sends it to the loser's bracket. Three, one. And uh, there's still no weapon on tent right now. Managing to finally find the guitars right there for just damage being done by Apollo right now. It's, it's almost inconceivable how wow. Tiffany is going to find their way out of this situation. The top of the stage and Apollo just getting right underneath them. Hits them there. Forces them over onto the gauntlet to continue juggling. Luna is the first stock and he has them off the side of the stage. Edge guard situation can cause them to come up here and he avoids the side stick. Great punish. And you can see that we're going to find out who can get that first stock. Luna already throwing out two different signatures, neither a third, and that's just going to be a confirming. This is why you're never truly safe against Impala. Tiffany just seems to have found that confidence in stage control uh, that we haven't seen previously in this set thus far. But Impala trying to fight their way out of the situation almost manages to take a stock right there. And I love the swap to the spear, the immediate sig right there. That was so good. Costas looking for any nice dodge from Impala. Oh! Oh! Finally gets the weapon. Gonna go for the down sig. There it is. Doesn't like teeter it over the edge though. That might have been able to catch Santi. There we oh. go. Like that. New gauntlet neutral light. Sare. With how far those are Not sending. Sare, the weapon toss goes a little oh. bit too far to the left. He must have done oh. that the wrong direction. That gives Impala the lead. He takes it back. But now Impala just needs some sort of a weapon, but it doesn't matter because they keep finding those ends nonetheless. Now they have a bow. Now they can start competing with Tiffany on a bit of even ground. And their conversions with the bow is spot on. Yeah, this is looking mighty rough for Tiff right now as Impala just seems to be doing it. You know, just a little bit better with this bow. Mm -hmm. And when someone's outdoing you with your very own weapon, you can kind of maybe cause a little bit of confidence issues because, you know, you have the identical weapon. Your punish game needs to be more than identical, though, to your opponents. And Jay is coming in with just a level <gasps> 18. Oh, yo, is he going to get the edge guard here? That's nice. Oh, my yo, gosh. Oh, I think he got it. That's not taking advantage after that. Stomp. That's it. No. Kaya defense. I keep forgetting. <gasps> oh, my goodness. I'm Oh, Whoa. just the gravity cancel haymaker. Wow. This is how you win neutral with bow. Definitely looking confident, very clean. A little bit of swag on it too, like a tasteful amount of swag on the things that Impala is doing. Not too reckless, not too oh. flashy, but enough. Oh man, and May just can't seem to find an answer. Impala oh, back my. with the juggles again, dude. Two weapon tosses, that's nothing compared to the damage that Impala's putting out right now. Okay. Come on, oh, Maze looking for something, and like nothing feels worse than when you're playing Scythe in tournament, in potentially the last game of it, and you can't get an early KO with your Scythe playoff stage. Instead, you're losing to unarmed and light, and you can't make it back. Oh, oh, recovery. oh snap! No. Oh, snap. gravity cancel sideline. Oh, okay, oh good. my goodness, he is really he's he's aggressively oh. 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 oh okay. So a few SIGs thrown out from Impala. It's going to be the recovery off the down line. Impala evens up the stock count. Weapon spawn coming in. There's the gauntlets. Needs another. Even if he gets knocked out here, that means next time he spawns back in, that next weapon is going to be a sight that's going to be his weapon of choice. How is he ready for every option? Last stocks. Game five. Impala with the stage control. He's got his comfort bow. Sandstorm. Catches the landing, but Impala gets back up. Impala's done a great job evening this up here. He's putting out a lot of damage on a Sandstorm here. It's getting close to where Sandstorm might have to start thinking about worrying about being disarmed if he takes too much more damage. Dude, the inlight into the recovery. Sandstorm oh. is so good at it. Yo, but Impala with the recoveries. Down Sig! Sandstorm, does he have the movement? Downlight misses. Who's gonna get the hit? Downlight! Nair! Impala takes it in game five! 
He's going to be your dream hack, San Diego champion. He went. Huge read on a jump out of the side light. Impala dodges down and manages to get out of it, but that D-Light side air could have been huge. Recovery hits an Impala, brings Sans from the orange. Another recovery, oh, Ajax. Oh my god, this has gotten so incredibly close here, Taza. Right now, he's webbed us up, going to go over to the Greatsword, see if he can try and close it. One of those new buffed enders, but that oh. depends if he gets a chance. Impala sending him back off stage. Weapon toss just gets him out. Oh, and the bounce and catches the landing. And what a finish coming up from Impala. Kind of getting into the orange of that second stack, but Impala's starting to get there too, but not without Impala saying, you know what, Bo comes in and gets the signature knockout. Yeah. Impala's spacing is just insane. As Luna dashes in, gets a D-Light, finds a side light, but nothing off of it. Impala hunting, making it look like he's going to go for a dare or recover with his bow, but he doesn't. Luna... Man, the spacing for Impala against these dares is looking so good so far. Luna hasn't connected on nearly any dare so far in the set. It's mostly the grounded options that Luna has been able to do, and Impala is just knocking him around in the air, not letting him land, not letting him stay on the ground at all. In the neutral signature, he reads the jump, and Impala makes it one more. Finally, Impala back on the bow, doesn't want the spear, holds the nair. Luna, it's not going to KO for a little while, but Impala is going to find the side sig, and it is going to do it barely in the corner. And, Impala and you just tell Impala's spot. here to win it. He threw that weapon straight up on top. If that didn't hit, then that weapon was going to hit. Oh, yeah, 100%. And we have Impala able to put a little bit of damage on experience. Experience <laughs> just he threw, can't dropped his weapon. He has it. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, oh my god! No he way. didn't even touch the ground. Oh my god! He oh god! Oh no! Experience. Oh, the champ is here, and the champ oh. is not here to play. This is, this is why. This is why he's the oh, champ. Oh man! Wow! Experience really having a hard oh time to touch the ground. Whoa. Impala. Oh, and it oh dropped. no, it dropped! No. The oh. Down. oh no! Small draw haven, but still, Godly is playing from behind. I feel like Impala is dashed from the Incredibles when he's running at the track meet. Ooh. And he's just going. Oh. And his family is telling him, whoa, slow down, slow down. It's so close to being Impala, getting a 3-0 and sending Godly to the elimination side of the bracket. Another Nair, a recovery, oh. and Impala does it! The upset king continues on as he is going into grand finals. Impala, a guaranteed top two finish. Bro stood there unfazed. You just 3-0'd. How are you feeling right now? Normal. <laughs> the grand finals, he hits the Sair. Godly still gets the wall touch. D-Light recovery. The low strength of Kaya. So many owls for Impala, but it's a dare to crown our new world champion. NA's taking home another gold, this time in the hands of Impala. Still has the headphones on. Impala, what an incredible performance. So relaxed, so calm, so chill. Another day in the park, and he's like, oh, I guess this is mine. I, I don't, I don't know, where am I going to put this on my shelf? Either way, he is your 1v1 Rahala World Champion! Hey everyone, thanks for watching this video B, and I'll see you guys all later. Peace.